Hi guys, welcome back to Where Stephanie Reads. Today I'm going to be doing another tag video and I'm going to be doing the Goodreads tag. So let's get started. The first question on the list is, what was the last book you marked as read? Uh, the last book I read that I marked as read was The Black Witch. And I loved it and for those that haven't seen my other videos, I mentioned how much I loved it and how it was like the book of the summer and it's really good. So if you want to learn more about it, I have the link below for the review. Or you can just check out my channel and see all the videos that I have like the book hang in my hand and stuff. So I'm like, so yeah. And the next question is, what are you currently reading? Well, I am currently reading this book called York. Can you see it? Uh, by Laura Ruby. It's really good so far. I mean, I totally recommend it so far. I'm really intrigued. It's like steampunk. There's inventions in here. There's like a cypherist. And it takes place in New York City, which I always wanted to go. It's like one of my dream places to go and to live. Maybe working for a publishing company there. And it just, you know, like it's a good book. So it's super fast paced. I mean, I'm kind of like this much into it but I know it's gonna be a good book so it's really good the next question on the list what was the last book you marked as as your TBR I actually marked a few few before I actually turned on the video so one of the books is called log like a boss which is like a great book to check out if you're looking to get into vlogging and also wanted to learn how to uh, create better videos and if you're new like me and who just wants to improve and need like a way of navigating through it is a really good book and another good book I marked as read is uh, The White Queen I actually didn't know this was like the second book in the series so now I have to look for the next book so uh, I'm not sure what the first book was, but it says on Goodreads that it's like number two. So, too bad. Anyway, the next question is, what book do you plan on to read next? Well, I'm going to be reading a book called The Circle called by Dave Eggers uh, because it's actually due in a few days and I need to read it so uh, and also this was also my TBR bit book and I been wanting to read it and I wanted to see the movie and stuff so I'm gonna be reading it so and plus it like I said it's due at the library so I have to read it it also goes for the other books so I'm gonna be reading read on it so so the next question is do you use the star rating system? Kind of when I feel like it. I mean, it does help me like think of the book like between like a scale or something, but sometimes I get lazy to think about a star system. And sometimes it's kind of like not as flexible because I would like if maybe Goodreads like had like a three and a half or something like that. So that way I can have more flexibility because sometimes I like a book but I'm not willing to read it again and sometimes I would like to read it three and a half to make it more like I like it and might read it again so it might be much more better um, like I have my own system of stars anyway so yeah I mean in the past I haven't used it but I'm starting to use it now and again so yeah and the next question is are you doing a 2014 reader challenge uh, technically it's not 2014 anymore so it's 2017 uh, but I am doing a reader good reads challenge this year I'm actually really behind and it's on like 44 books on there but I guess I kind of like took too long with some books but at least I got a whole year or so yeah and it's kind of less than what I usually do uh, the first time I did it was like a hundred books and read about 103 books in that year but I just had to scale down because it was, was way too much and I had more things going on so yeah and the next question is do you have a wish list 
who doesn't have a wish list? I mean, every time I read a good book, and I go to the library a lot, and that's where I get most of my books, especially good, uh, good book sales are awesome, and it's way cheaper than going to a used bookstore, and I am kind of broke most of the time, so I always have change, and I can always throw it out at book sales, so, and other than that, I borrow most of the books. I don't buy books that I haven't read, so as much especially full price full price is way too expensive and the next question is uh, what book do you plan to buy next not really sure um, I can say what books I would like to buy next um, I would like to buy the King's Cage from the Red Queen series I also would love to buy pretty much the York book that I started reading and also the, the Black Witch and my list keeps on going and I'm saving it for my birthday. But I usually don't really know when I'm going to buy a book. Uh, I usually go to book sales and you never know what you're going to get. So it's kind of like, it's kind of like a mixture of everything. So, but it's kind of cool. So, you know, do you have any favorite quotes? Um, not really. I don't really think about them. I always keep forgetting like some things in the book that I like. But right now I'm kind of like drawing a blank. Uh, who are your favorite authors? I have a lot of favorite authors. I'm a huge fan of Cassandra Clare. I love The Mortal Instruments. I love The Infernal Devices. I, I forgot what the last one was about. But uh, I like all of it. I love Shadow Hunters. My other favorite author is Dan Brown. Ever since I read Da Vinci Code and the rest of the series of Robert Langdon. In fact, I'm excited that the new book is coming out this year in October. Uh, it's called Origin. So if I were you, I'd totally pre-order it. I'm going to reserve it at the library, put it on my birthday list because I know it's going to be good. Uh, my other favorite author is Neil Schusterman. Ever since I read uh, Downsiders, which is a really good book, I totally recommend checking it out if you like science fiction and uh it's about like where uh, this girl meets this boy who happens to live in a city below New York City. So it's kind of like really interesting. I also love um, Rachel Kane. I'm a huge fan of the Morganville Vampires. And I like the Ink and Bone series. And the new book is coming out, Ash and Quill. Can't wait. I also uh, like Susan Denard after Truth Witch. I'm now a huge fan. And uh, let's see, another favorite author of mine. I I like um, what was the other one? Um, let's see, uh, you know the one that I wrote, uh, Red Queen. Yeah, I like the one that wrote Red Queen. Uh, yeah, I have so many. I like uh, yeah, so. I have so many favorite authors. Every time I read a new book, it becomes my new favorite author. So, let's see. Have you joined any groups? Yes, I have a lot of groups. I don't keep up with all of them. I'm always behind. But I am part of them. I am part of the Hooked on Books one, which I did a readathon a while ago. I'm part of the Hashtag Yearathon, uh, the Book Riot uh, ch Challenge one. I'm also part of the one um, Little Book Club. I'm part of the Where Seven New Reads Challenge, which I actually started myself. Only six few members, but uh, anybody wants to join, continue. Uh, you can are invited. I'm on the Goodreads Author Readers Book Club, uh, Pre Utopia Book Club, Lonely Generous Book Club, which is like uh, started by Sarah Without H. I'm part of the Morganville Vampires Fans Club, uh, YouTube Book Reviewers. I'm part of the Read Along with Price is Ra Wrong, uh, the Rory Gilmore Reading Challenge. I'm a huge Gilmore Girl fan, so if you're a fan, let me know. Uh, I'm on Jess Team, um, on Dewey 24 Hours Readathon. I'm on the Ender G one. And I'm also on something old, something new. I'm on many clubs. I join them on every single few weeks whenever I think of something. So, I mean, I haven't kept up with all of them, uh, but I am part of all of them. So, yeah, I also am on Goodreads. So, yeah. 
and let's see I'm also the next question no that is the I guess that's it so if you like this video and want to see me do more tag videos let me know in the comments and I'm also on Goodreads so if you want to add me as a friend or just follow me I write reviews the whole time I'm also on social media all over the place my links are in the bottom and if you want to keep up with my channel, uh, click on subscribe, which is the red button that says subscribe. And if you want to be notified whenever I have a new video, uh, click on the one that looks like a bell. And until next time, keep on reading.